Hi everyone, let's go through this question on speed and this question is actually from the past uh, PSLE math paper and I found this question to be pretty challenging alright so let's go through this May and Ling took part in a cycling race May cycle at a speed of 20 km per hour both of them did not change their speed throughout the race when Ling covered half of the distance May was 3.5 km in front of her. May reached the finishing line at 10.45 am and what time did Ling finish the finishing line? Alright, so let's uh, digest the question. Okay, so we have uh, two girls taking part in a cycling race. Okay, this is the speed of May, which is a 20 km per hour. Alright, so when Ling covered half of the distance, okay, May was 3.5 km in front of her. So from this statement, can you tell me who is faster, May or Ling? The answer is May, right? Because uh, May is 3.5 km ahead of Ling, okay? When Ling covers half of the distance. And now, here's the important question, okay? When Ling is at the halfway point, May was 3.5 km ahead of her. So my question to you is, if Ling has completed the journey, how much will May be ahead? The answer is 7 km. Okay, why is that so? Right, because when Ling is at the halfway point, May is 3.5 km ahead of her. So when Ling reaches a fishing point, May will be 7 km ahead of her. And how do you get 7? You simply take 3.5 times 2, right? You get 7. Okay, so now what, did, what do we do next? Right, since we know that May speed is 20 km per hour, right, we take 7, okay, we take 7 divided by 20, you get 0 0.35 hour, and this will stand for the time that May completed the race ahead of Ling. Right, make sense? Right, because when Ling completed the race, May was 7 km ahead, so you take the distance divided by the speed, you get the time, and this will be the time which May completed the race earlier. Alright, so now we convert these hours to minutes. So when you want to convert hour to minute, you times 60. 0 0.35 times 60, you get 21 minutes. And now, the question says that May reached a finishing line at 10.45 am. Okay, so they want to find a time that Ling reached a finishing line. Okay, my question to you is, do you add these 21 minutes to this 10.45 am or do you minus? Okay, the answer is you have to add. Okay, why is that so? Because remember, right, May is faster, right? Okay, so if May is faster, it means that Ling, okay, will reach 21 minutes later than May. Alright, so we got to find a time, okay, which is 21 minutes after 10.45 a.m. Okay, to do this, let's draw a timeline. You plus 15 minutes first, you get 11 a.m. Then from there, you plus another 6 minutes. Okay, because 15 plus 6 gives you 21 minutes. And so the final answer will be 11.06 a.m.